And uh, welcome back. Thank you again for watching Sunday Brunch with Lubna. And our number is 855-886-6387, extension 4. And now we are discussing a topic. I will wrap up the topic. And those who are bad, I am sorry, but that is reality. This was our discussion that people are devaluing someone's car, someone's profession, someone's profession, someone's profession, someone's profession, someone's profession. You don't value it. I thought that we are talking about some good things with you. We are talking about some good things with you. اور کبھی کبھار ہم انجانے میں کچھ چیزیں غلط کر رہے ہوتے ہیں تو hopefully through this show you're going to prove yourselves and اگر کوئی آپ کے ساتھ ایسے کر رہا ہے تو میرا پروگرام کو لگا دی گا جب آپ کے ہاں ہیں کہ سنیں ذریعہ پروگرام دیکھیں آج کا anyway all jokes aside that was a topic and I think I do want to share these beautiful pieces ان لوگ کے دھیر سارے art pieces تھے you guys had humongous pieces of art میں نے کبھی ہمارا studio اتنا بڑا نہیں ہے جب انشاءاللہ اس سے بڑا ہوگا تو ہم کھڑے ہو کے دکھائیں گے بڑے بڑے جو ایک دیوار کے سائز کی ان کے دونوں کے art work ہیں we'll start off with you Fahim if you can show this amazing art pieces to our audience and tell us what kind of art is this okay so this is it's a script basically it's a square kufik Okay. Uh, it says uh, Ali and Muhammad, and it's like uh, ref uh, reflecting uh, nice. on four know. sides, and you, as you can see that. Very so nice. It's a, it's a digital uh, mixed media. Wow. So. Very nice. They can add some be art, different types of arts. So, and that's the also a square, uh, it's a Kufic print, a uh, mm -hmm. Kufic uh, script. So what kind of script is it? Kufic script. Kufic. Okay. And um, it's also, like it's handwritten. Of handwritten. Course, it's so this is all hand work that you do with yeah, the mark? Okay. Hand, like it's a free yeah. and a hand, free hand. Okay. That's amazing. Yeah. And these things can be framed, but obviously oh, yeah. because of the camera, we had to get some stuff Absolutely. off. Absolutely. Okay. And it says Apple Kursi. Apple Kursi, okay. Yeah. And uh, it's, again, it's a digital, uh, digital, digital media. Digital. And... Uh, very nice, mashallah. So it Very shows nice. the little. I mean, you have the atul kursi in there, and yet it's a piece of art. So you yeah, can it looks a little mashallah. like, and and it's a good part that you know, some mm -hmm. of the exhibition you're gonna see a lot of different type of artwork. Mm -hmm. Now this is a, it's a sculpture piece. It's a 3D. 3D. Uh, okay. Kind of like so it has a, you see that a lot of uh, scripts on there. Right. Basically, um, has a square kufik, and there is a different mm -hmm. scripts on there too, different languages. And yeah, that's when I ask the different languages. Did you design that yourself? I mean, I see like Spanish, I see Hebrew, I see Arabic. So I put together that, and okay. if you look at it as a whole, uh -huh. um, I don't know if you have noticed yet or not, but it's actually a face, and okay. these are the eyes. The and eyes, and and okay. Are. And it's a pretty contemporary abstract because that's some of my work that do reflect the abstract work, okay. which I mainly focus on with the Islamic art, with Islamic the abstract. Art, right. And it shows the, the title of his work as Identity. Identity. So, yeah. And it's 3D because it's kind of popping out. Yeah. I, I'm sure that they're yeah. catching it. Um, yeah. Okay. Very nice. Very, very different, but very nice. Yes. So, and then the writings, the different languages, you do these yourself? So, not, not all of them because these are print. Prints. So, they're print just are the them Arabic out. that I do. Okay. Uh, and English, I have. It kind of uh, like I'm, Picasso kind of a thing, right? Who so. knows? I mean, you know, we could have a. They see oh, Picasso so, one day. Okay. But I do English calligraphy as well, English along with the Arabic calligraphy, handwritten. Uh -huh. uh, but it's more main like abstract work that I do, okay. which uh, reflects, mm -hmm. uh, connects the uh, East and West. So together. how long does it take you? I mean, I know these are all different pieces of art, and I'm sure there's different concepts behind it. How long does it take you to make each piece of art? Like, for example, how long did it take you to make this one? So It's a uh, tough question. but it, No, it's like handwritten, again, uh, depend on um, if handwritten is... Um, when you're sitting down, it may take you know a few hours, or it may some of the calligraphy that if it's just a script that you're writing, mm -hmm. you're mm -hmm. going with the flow, then it doesn't take too long. Again, right. if you're dealing with mixed media, uh, which is involved with the painting, or you're doing the sculpting, or you're doing the woodwork, which I right. do as well, okay, um, that may take months, several months. Several months, right? Yeah. And what is the largest piece of art that you have made? So far, I think uh, the largest span that I had done, which was uh, uh, last year, was uh, 12 feet wide, okay. mm -hmm. and it uh, was uh, 8 feet high, yeah, 8 feet wow, high and wow. 12 or 14 feet wide. Wow. Yeah. 14 um, feet wide, I take it back, yeah. Wow. 
Amazing. When next time we'll show it. I scratch my own bigger. canvases, so yes. it oh gives an goodness. opportunity. So of course, I very nice. Very nice. Scratch, yeah. Well, I'm happy that you shared these pieces with us. And now, um, Samia, aap the kind of aapki jodne khubsurat aapki bhi art pieces. Mere By the way, itne khubsurat hain. All the work I saw this beforehand. It's beautiful. Many bade pieces. They're a little more abstract, but mm -hmm. these are small pieces that I've done. These are you know series. See, this uh -huh. is inspired by. Turkish, Turkish ornamentation. Mm -hmm. So there it says Allah. Allah, and it's got that Turkish Tezib, my take on it with right. you know right. acrylics. So the colors is that oil that you uh, put on that? No, like the gold this is acrylics. Acrylics, paints. okay. Yeah. Oh, sorry, you said acrylics. Yeah. Okay. See how much I know about art. Yeah, I'm probably it's saying okay. it. It's okay. But right. it's very yeah. nice. The colors, the design. You can, when, when it's dry, you can't tell oil from you oh, know oil. acrylics. So. See, so I wasn't. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> So the colors and stuff, all of that is all handwork. The, the design yes, on it. Absolutely, yeah. Okay. This is freehand, and you know, um, it's it's a lot of fun doing this. I'm, coming I'm up, I'm sure. With and you could do so much with it, mashallah, right? Yeah, I mean, the, yeah, the way it absolutely. Is. So this is a series, and there's like other, you know, little pieces on the same basis. Mm -hmm. This is uh, Sur Heman, and this is on nature. Okay. So, okay. like, I just take, a, you know, trees, flowers, whatever. Right. And this is actually combining my previous art training, I would think, uh -huh. with my calligraphy now. This is, you know, more mixed. You kind of mix it up. G. So, Yasura Rahman or SubhanAllah, then I can do, like, you know, nature and put that in there, basically. Right, right. Yeah. right. And the colors, I, I like the way the colors are, that it's... It's not just uh, one plain color. You can you can play with so many different colors. Absolutely, and it's such a lively, uh, beautiful yeah. mashallah. Yeah. Very it's just nice. the texture. I like the textures. You know, mm -hmm. just doing heavy textures and so forth. And this is uh, my classic calligraphy. I would say, like Bismillah oh, Rahman it's, very it's just like you know, acrylics again. Okay. And classical calligraphy. So. So how do you uh, when you do the colors? You just just pick out a bunch of colors. Yes, absolutely. But then they have to kind of like the way you have the colors. Basically, you have the rainbow in there. You have all yeah. the seven colors in yes. it. Yeah, and then the you black. have to you have to play with it. You have to play with it to uh -huh. get it right. Sometimes it can be really off. Agar ek dafa ap sare colors ek saath dal de to you know what you get brown and black. So you have to be you know sure that they kind mm -hmm. of blend well and. Stages make a number thing. Right, so that's the beauty of the art. Okay. You can, there's freedom. Yeah. The freedom. I mean, there, there's so much. I mean, I'm, I mean, I'm looking at them, and Masha, this piece is. I mean, all of them are amazing, but that one really, Masha, it's, it's very beautiful. But uh, I was going to ask you. So this, uh, the way you wrote that on top, um, it was done at the end. I'm guessing, right? Gee, I'm so absolutely. sorry. By the way, I'm not an artist, nayo, so that's why I'm asking you. Because those people who are watching, they have some knowledge. I say, and me definitely. So that's done at the end. Yes, right? absolutely. The, the color yeah. and. Uh, how long does it take you to do a piece like this, approximate? Uh, you know what, I need to time myself. This uh, <laughs> is the base, it's the most important time. Hota hai. You have to pour colors, let it dry, mix right. it, and so forth. So, it looks like that you're just, you know, mm -hmm. computer mm -hmm. on the computer, then you come back to it and you do it. So right, right. I haven't really strictly timed myself. You have to time it. And next yes. time, tell me. I, absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> okay. So. okay, no, I mean, it, it, they're all, all beautiful pieces. And I think, you know, uh, the people watching right now, it's an inspiration. I mean, right. for especially the... I think, you know, as an artist, mm -hmm. coming up with the original inspiration is the right. hard part. Right. Once you get it done, then, you know, you can... So yesterday it, so. was the Islamic festival. So you guys had these things over there uh, yes, yes. yesterday, and I know there are other artists over there too. So there's all different kinds of things. Yeah, I think we have 35 artists yes, among us. 35 yes. artists. So has it ever been where there were identical pieces? I mean, no, might be the same thing, no. but no, I think it's, it's, rarely. It's, it's, Everybody has their own take. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. I will do it this way. Another somebody lady, will do it different. Absolutely. Way. So you can see the variations or uh -huh. different presentations. You know, right, right. Uh, you have uh, people over there working with henna, henna on, right, canvas. Of course. on canvas. You have well. people doing gloss, and you know, there's so many mediums right, and so course. many different ways to come to the same thing mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. it's it's very interesting. I of think. course, Mashallah, yeah. the artists that we have, uh -huh. like uh, amazing talent. Amazing, I'm sure. I mean, I, I can just see two of this artist. Came up, it's like you know, it's so talented, you right, know, and right. unique. Right. Very of unique. Course, very Even unique. the Islamic art, but it's all unique. And you, we needed this platform to show it in. Of course. And uh, Sami, I was going to ask you, what has been the largest piece that you have? Uh, I would, I would not of? say as big as Fahim Samani, uh -huh. but I would say a six by four is the biggest. But those are pretty time. big. I mean, yeah. you could think about. I mean, you're talking yeah. about six feet. 
You know what? There was one I did. See, now she didn't. Yeah, I'm just thinking. That was 12 by 4. Right. And that was actually for a furniture store. That was a black drop, and I did an abstract. But that was not Islamic Islamic. Art, but, but that was the biggest one I did. And I think with, with things like this, with beautiful pieces like this, I think people in their homes, they can really you know, make their home look even nicer with these things. Because Absolutely. this is something where I think even uh, teenagers would want in their rooms or even like, you know, even like the modern society would want, people would want things like this in the room to right. add that because there's a typical thing and then there's this. And you can customize it too. Obviously. Absolutely. You know, right. our focus is so much on shalwar kameez and sure. dawat and this and that. But, you know, the art pieces that my parents have bought, it's been in the house for like 20, 30 years. Oh, so, yeah, ek jiza you see every day. Every day. And you right. should, you know, That's spend beautiful. money on it, appreciate it, like it. Of course. You know, of course. Sal right. sal <laughs> Definitely. And uh, sadly, my time wrap up is very quickly. Uh, I want to uh, start off with you. Thank you so much for coming out, for being a part of the show. Thank you for having me. Thank you yeah. so much. And uh, I know you guys are busy. And even to you, Samia, thank you, thank so, you much. so much for coming thank you, out. Thank you. And I hope you guys had a good time on the show today. <laughs> no, no, we had a good time, actually. We've been following your show now recently, just started. Following my show? Okay. Yeah, so, so that's, uh, I, know, I guess it recently enjoyable. happened. Uh, yeah. I have to catch up on some, but some. yeah, we have some been watching. Channel, yeah, so Definitely. it's good. And, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, no, thank you so much. Inshallah, that's the whole point of the show, to bring uh, programs like this. You just said just a talent here. You have to show them here. And I know YouTube has some shows, but on TV1, if you go to TV1, subscribe. And if you have a house, you can subscribe. But I'm sure a lot of people, uh, the buzz is going, and a lot of people know about it. Anyway, uh, thank you to both of you. Uh, beautiful work. I'm going to take some pieces of the house, but I'm going to take it to the But anyway, uh, thank you so much, you all, that you all have started with Sunday afternoon with TV1. You can see TV1, and you can see all the shows. Dear Sari programs, Aplong Kilie. Janice Pele, of course, I do want to thank Rup Sari Palace for providing me this beautiful wardrobe. Absurd jacket, they can Rup Sari Palace. Now, I've canvases with the Hubsurth, Hubsurth art, they can, Mahajaki, they can, Saria, Shark Mises, Judy Dars Langes. I mean, you really need to go and uh, go see this place, uh, Rup Sari Palace. And of course, um, just I'm looking to Mesha Kathy Honke, you know, Apke Jo Rishadar Hen, Jopke Dost Hen, Jopke Prosi, Unse Millen, Zurine, Kap Hurd, then Millen, they can schedule current. I mean, I mean, Egg Barbie Jai, they can schedule. With your friends and family, but get there. Don't don't find a reason to get together when something bad happens. Try to remember what's going on uh, with each other. Anyway, take the TV one. Inshallah, Allah Hafiz.